And Enlo Health is cutting down some of its women health services. A lot of patients, including me, receive letters and emails warning that some routine care services will have to go through our primary providers instead of OBGYNs. Well, uh, Action News Now reporter Margot Rowe is live now at the hospital in Chico. So Margot, what's happening here? Alan, so starting November 15th, Enlo will be referring women who want to do women wellness exams to go to go to their primary doctors. And the reason for this is actually they're trying to open up more appointments for pregnant women and women with acute GYN concerns. Now, I spoke with an Enlo gynecologist and Enlo midwife, and they say in our area and across the state, there are more pregnant women than there are services. Recently, there have been times where Enlo's had to postpone care appointments for pregnant women. So the goal is to not only up, open up more appointments but to offer them sooner. We hope that the message gets conveyed that this is out of a need to be able to reach our patients that need us most in a timely fashion and, um, and spread our resources a little bit more effectively. Now, Enlo says they are hoping that this is temporary as Women's Health Services isn't just seeing people from Butte County, but they're also seeing people from other counties that lack OB care. And Enlo says that they are actively recruiting providers and they're actually in the interview process for one right now. Reporting in Chico, I'm Margot Rowe for Action News Now. Thank you, Margot. Butte County Public Health says even though Enlo Health is restricting services across four of its women's health clinics, there are still several clinics dedicated, excuse me, <clears throat> still uh, dedicated to women's health care across the county. And some of the clinics include Northern Valley Indian Health, Women's Health Center in Chico, Oroville Women's Health Clinic off Olive Highway, and both public health clinics in Chico and Oroville. 